When you look at your, your last film, The Bunny Heads, that we just saw, what are the, who are some of the people who might have influenced you? Do you see any direct oh, influences well, who coming might have through in your film? Me, in, when I look at a film like Bunny Heads, I mean, like Bunny Heads, because Bunny, there is no, there are no other films I made that are anything like Bunny Heads um, that I made. But um, let's see what could have. Well, I, I often say that um, that the environment that it takes place in is kind of a cross between Fritz Lang's uh, Metropolis and under somebody's basement stairs. You know, the characters in there are based on sculptures by Christine Burdett and. So, first I saw these sculptures that Christine did of the, of the, the, bunny, the bunny critter and uh, the, those uh, kind of matrix, matrix critters with the little, little Martha, what I call the Martha Washington hats. And so I saw all those as sculptures in a show. And I, so I got the idea of, of the question came up, uh, gee, wouldn't it be impossible to make a film about, based on these, you know? That's sort of the way that it came up. You know, it was. I was fascinated with these sculptures. They were very touching to me and mysterious. And so, I mean, it doesn't necessarily mean, therefore, that they would make a good film. So the question was, if I would, if if I were to make a film, what kind of film would it be? You know, I mean, are they? What are they? What kind of behavior are these beings supposed to exhibit anyway? So we did a lot of experimenting to see how expressive they could be and the answer turned out to be not very you know I mean really you know that they're not really very conscious beings they're kind of programmed beings they're something like termites or or you know somewhere between a termite and a stick yeah that that rabbit film really fascinated me the, uh, this the business of the two-dimensional representations of three-dimensional things, then, you know, these are all, you know, kind of violations of, in a sense, of what I was trying to do when I started moving things around spatially. You know, I, I was, I don't, I wasn't probably bold enough to let something come up so close that, that you saw yeah. its dots and stuff like that. You know, I was still operating in a kind of an illusionistic with a sort of illusionistic aesthetic.